My name is Daniel Herman. I'm the curator of modern and contemporary projects at the National Gallery in London. And today I'm delighted to speak here at the Museo Thyssen Bornemisza about Lucien Freud, one of the most important figurative painters of the 20th century and one of the most interesting painters to talk about when it comes to the topic of intimacy. In this painting, two men from 1987 and 1988, we can see a naked figure. Two people are lying in a bed or on a mattress. One of them is clothed, the other one is unclothed. What we can see is a single hand just very gently touching the thigh of the friend, the partner in the bed. This is not to titillate. It is to show us a human connection, to show us a relationship of which we become part as beholders. This idea of intimacy going beyond eroticism and actually encompassing the whole full nuance of human emotion and human relationships is what makes Lucien Freud's painting so exciting. Lucien Freud's painting took months to finish. It was not just a single session where a painting would be finished. It would be a process that would take days, weeks and months during which the artist would expect the sitters to be present. Here, the sitters are Bella and Esther, Lucien Freud's daughters. What we can see is two women sitting on a sofa in the studio of the artist. That shows us the joy of family, that shows us the intimacy of siblings with all the problems that we might have with that. But it also shows us that the artist is using painting as a medium to create time for family. For Lucien Freud, this painting occupied several months of his life. Several months that he would spend with the children in his studio. He might not have been a perfect father, but there are nuances of intimacy that feed into his work, which he prized over everything else. This nuance of talking about Lucien Freud in all its complexity is really what we have tried to achieve with our exhibition here at the Museo Thyssen Bornemisza and at the National Gallery in London.